no guys this is crazy but guess what it is a learning lesson most people inside the united states of america they see the crisis that is happening with these illegal immigrants that coming across their border but guess what most people turn a blind eye to the situation because they're not being affected by these people because they're not dropping off these people in their neighborhood but guess what guys they love to use these people for cheap labor they love to hire these people because they want to pay them below minimum wage little and nothing and guys what what i'm gonna share with you that happened in this video i mean it's a learning lesson but I feel some type of way I don't know if I feel happy I don't know if I feel sad but it's a mixed feelings but it's unbelievable and I feel I feel it for I feel I felt it for that homeowner as well but it's a learning lesson as I said before when you love to hire these illegal immigrant can't even speak English barely can answer barely can understand what you are saying so guys i'm gonna share this video with you you help me to be the judge down in the comment section let's check it out i'm not gonna tell you what it's all about just let's watch it guys no yes no i said only the bathroom oh. only the bathroom you did all this for you did all that. Can't speak English. Can't speak English. Only. 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 What did he tell you? None of them can speak English. Guys. What? English. English. Back to the honest. Maybe. English? The man cannot speak English. No, I'm going to end up paying. No, le vas a hablar a la policía? You. No, I didn't say anything. I said the, only the bathroom. Only the bathroom. Wait, <laughs> You didn't even start the bathroom. One little piece. And all of this is gone. Guys, this video is a learning lesson to most of you guys that love to use these illegal immigrants for cheap labor. This is what it costs. It can cost you some time. And it can even cost you bigger issue and bigger problem more than this. Because you don't even know these people that you employ to do your work. Inviting them in your house. These people walk, come across, walk, walk across the U.S. border. No vetting. None of those things. This is a result. This is a prime example. When you love to use these illegal immigrants to do your cheap work, to do your dirty work, that you said black Americans don't want to do because they are lazy. They are not lazy because they're not gonna work for those little penny that you're paying these illegal immigrants. These people don't used to money like that these people work like these people work five dollars for five dollars an hour. These illegal immigrants, little or nothing, anything you give them, they will take it. But you always once said, "Oh, American citizens are lazy because they don't want to do certain work." It's not that you don't plan to pay them what the work value, what the job value. That's the problem. That's what you need to say out loud. You're using these people to cut your grass for little or nothing. A lot of American citizens do those kind of work. Like, 
land like land escape what you call it, what you call it that cut grass cut tree make a yard look nice a lot of people a lot of company with american citizen own those landscaping job company but guess what you want to use these illegal immigrants to for cheap labor it's all about cheap labor If you do, if you look it up on Google, you see a lot of these companies that do those jobs. American citizen. But you don't want to use them because you don't want to pay them a hundred dollars to cut your yard. You want to pay these illegal immigrant and Mexican $25 and all those money. <laughs> yeah. Those people is taking over everything. You don't see every car wash now. It's Mexican, Mexican, Mexican. Cheap to wash your car. These people are going to destroy your guy, um, your guy's co country. I'm telling you, they're gonna destroy your guy's company. They're gonna take all of your job. A lot of people might say, "Oh no, they cannot take our job." Trust me, they're going to do it because they work for little and nothing. I'm telling you, they work for little and nothing. Why would you? Why would you? Pay someone, for example, why would you pay someone a hundred dollars to cut your yard when you can pay a Mexican, a illegal immigrant, twenty-five dollars to cut your yard? Tell me which one you're gonna pay. No matter how you say, oh, no matter how you said, tell yourself, say, oh, I wanna support my 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 American brothers or American sisters that that own that company. You're gonna think to yourself and say, hell no. When I can save so much money, when I can save $75, why would I pay $100 when I can pay $25 to do the same job and even do it better? Think about that. You go to the car wash and you used to pay like $50 to wash your car. And you can get your car to wash for $15. Which one you gonna choose? You gonna support you're American citizen, are you gonna support? Are you gonna pay that $15? Just think about it. In the back of your mind, you will say, Wow, I want to support my American brothers or sister, but on the other hand, you're gonna tell yourself, Janos, you're gonna tell yourself, say, Wow, I could use these $35 to put some gas in my car and spend the $15 to wash my car. You, you get the mercy. You get the drift. So these people going to cause a problem in the long run. It might not gonna happen right now, but in the long run, guys, the rate that these people is flooding in the United States of America. Just look at this video, guys. Look at these people that just walking in, walking in, walking in, walking in, walking in, walking in. You see them just walking in, walking in, walking in, non-stop, walking in, walking in, walking in, walking in. And this thing happen every day, all day. People just walking in, walking in. You, you know how much in stadium you could fool? You know how much in stadium you could fool? With the rate of these people just walking in non-stop, mean all day, just keep coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in. I mean, that is crazy. That is crazy. But guess what? When it's reaching your neighborhood, that's the time you're gonna scream or you're gonna cry because it's not affecting you. Because they, these people, they're not dropping off these people in your in your city, whatever where you live close by you you don't so then destroy new york city with all kind of shit and piss up the place that's gonna be a health hazard in the long run because you know new york have a lot of rats and all these illegal immigrants just keep shitting up the street in new york and those rats gonna nyam those shit you understand messi it's problem just be a problem but guys this video is a learning lesson if you're gonna if you're gonna employ one of these illegal immigrants, they cannot speak English. Get a translation. Use your phone. Use your phone. You can use your phone. 
Well, I'm not even going to give you no games because you need to get proper people to do your job. Let me know, guys, what you think about this video down in the comment section. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a great day.